I tried to marry a few different women in my youth as a young, handsome pastor. I tried. But kechiche? Or down? But when it was God's time for God's strategy, God's plan for my life, some people didn't like her. Some of my associates said, no, you must not marry this one. They had their own candidates. <laughs> she won the primaries. <laughs> and I'm her primary. I'm her secondary. Tasha. She's my chick on the side. She's my date tonight. She's my still waters, my green pastures. If I... My Asaba princess. I saw her on the eighth row. I got up to preach. She was not on my mind. I'd never met her before, never seen her. My Bible was in front of me. I was about to preach a message called God has changed the rules. And I was suddenly given a deep peace that the woman you've been praying for for three years, that's her there. She's your wife. I did not approach her for three months. I prayed, if this is your will, bring your will. Because I knew that the issue of woman. <laughs> the rest is history. She's here now, 25 years. Forgive me, Uncle Intiense. Bring 36, 26, double D, 34, 85, however you call it. This is the best. Her worth is far more than rubies. Many women have done well, but none of them compare to this one. Go and get your own. Please, can I get a witness? My whole life, I don't spoil bad, bad to say I don't marry this woman. And then, in the reach 45 plus, it's still fine. When time to pray, come inside, be pray. Time to preach, come inside, be preach. To make up one for house. Uh, I can trust her. My heart is safely trusted that she was God's strategy for my life. Your God is a strategic God. Even marriage is a strategic matter for God. It might not be for you. It might just be love, passion, and, and somebody ticking the boxes. But for God, it is a strategic matter. So, get your strategy. Stop trying to force God to bless what you want to do. 